Dried blood, you say? The blood would still be sticky and fresh if it belonged to our man. Let this man go immediately. Very well, my lord. You're finally to die, you piece of shit. I've nothing to do with all this. My lot kept out of it from the start. I don't give a damn. You've been a pain in our asses for far too long. For what crime do you wish to punish this man? He belongs to an organized gang currently ruling over the port. They hold the merchants to ransom. They all pay with coin or their lives. We have good relations with the merchants on the port. They appreciate our protection. Protection? Don't make me laugh. We finally have the chance to get our hands on him. River Spring will be better off without him. What were you doing during the rioting? I live in the inn overlooking the port with some friends. We haven't set foot outside since the revolt started. A group of armed guards arrived and dragged me off in the middle of a game of cards. So, that is River Spring justice, huh? Quick executions without reason? Send him to the dungeons. Our friend already knows the way. You're making a grave error, my lord. You'll pay for what you did, whore. I wish you had been in your squalid house as it burned. What are you accusing her of? She set fire to my house. I found the bitch admiring her work and celebrating. Yes, I set the fire, and I'm proud of it. That monster deserves a lot worse. If you set his house on fire, you do realize that a lord can cut off your hands for far less than that. Oh, oh, please, don't cut off my hands, my lord. Your guard there, he took advantage of the rioting to violate my little sister. I found her in tears, unable to speak. You can't call that rape. The girl didn't even put up a fight. I'll get you and make you eat your own shit. Your behavior is the cause of all this. You are the only person here who deserves punishment. Send him to the dungeons while I decide his fate, and let this woman go. I cannot thank you enough, my lord. Are you done, my lord? Yes, but no one is to take such decisions in the future without telling me first. Try to at least hear what they have to say before passing sentence. Is that understood? Yes, my lord. So that is how you plan to quiet the rioting, by getting the townsfolk to side with you? Open this gate. I'm going to town. I understood. What is going on here? There's an angry mob on the other side of the door. We closed the portcullis behind them. Ha, the idiots are stuck inside. But it should be fine. The door is strong. Very well. Keep the door closed until further notice. Very well, my lord. Open the gate. I'm returning to the castle. Very well. Calm down. There is no point in going to such extremes. I am aware that things are not going well here, but burning down the castle won't make things any better. So, what do you suggest? We are starving!
We are going to put a new tax on the nobility and their property. This will help us bring in food for those most in need. We just need a little time to put everything in place. This isn't the first promise we've heard. I know how difficult it is for you to get through each day, but everything will be done to improve your conditions as soon as possible. Well, for once, noble corn will serve to do something other than deepening our misery. Come along, men! Let's go home! I'm sorry, my lord. Tyrek asked us to keep them here for as long as possible. Do not kill us. We beg of you. I suppose it would be unfair to kill you for so little. Ah, oh, your leniency shall not be forgotten. You've gotten us out of a bad situation, Captain. We'll join the others once we're ready. 